What's up guys, it's Dev Creations here, bringing you part 3 of my Balloonist Guide for the Unfinished Swan. This time we're doing chapter 3, Night Time. So to start things off, we are going to be in the woods, and there are 6 balloons in this part. Um, so the first one, you'll be going up to the first uh, light, as you can see here. And just past the light, if you look up to the left, uh, you may be able to see it. Um, just above the uh, moon there is the first balloon hidden in the shadows so jump up to be able to hit that one and moving on uh, you're going to drop down this little part and see the first blue light in the level and just after it to the left is your second balloon so the third balloon you're going to be going under this little archway made of the broken broken tree and the uh, statue thing and as you just go past it, if you look to the left again, there is the third balloon. Moving on to the fourth one, this is literally just after the previous one. You're going to see this uh, blue light, and if you look just to the right, just before we get to the, uh, as you can see, the half log uh, shoot there, is the fourth balloon. Moving on to the fifth one, you're going to go down this hill. And the hill is actually in two parts. It goes down the first part, flattens off, and then goes down again. But what you want to do is go down the first part, but don't go down the second. What you want to do is turn around and then hit the ball back up the hill. Because the uh, the balloon is actually in a cave that you go past on the way down. But because the ball's moving so fast, you don't have time to turn around and get it. And there it is just there. So the last one for this part is just through this little tunnel. If you turn around and look up, there is the balloon above the tunnel on top of the rocks. But as you can see there, you can't actually reach it from there. So what you need to do is just come up the hill uh, just a little bit and then try and jump on the ball. If you jump off the ball and <laughs> rapidly fire the uh, paintballs, you should be able to hit it after a few tries. So onto the river, there are two balloons, and the first one is right near the beginning, I think. Um, if You basically just stick next to the river and look over the left side. And, well, you can see it there, it was just before this uh, drawbridge thing with the frog on it, on the left side. And the second one is just after this little waterfall. If you look to the right, you're going to see a crocodile and the uh, balloon just on the opposite side. So jump over <laughs> and get it. Uh, onto home, there are three balloons and the first one is just before you go into the uh, that painting thing, uh, go to the right hand side and you'll see this balloon over the back poking up uh, over the wall. So next you're going to jump straight through the, uh, the picture frame and as soon as you get in there, turn around look up and there is the balloon and the final one again just as you've come through go around to the left hand side of the uh, the house and make some stairs as you can see here like I've done and make your way up to the top there and look behind the house and you're gonna see the balloon which for me this was the very final balloon that I needed to get for the trophy uh, so moving on to the nursery there are six in this part and as you're going to see just here this is right at the beginning as soon as that sign comes up turn left and there it is just outside the second one is going to be just as you fall into this picture frame there's the balloon to the right there uh, so once you fall all the way down just <laughs> don't fall off the edge uh, make your way to the edge and uh, shoot the balloon that's on the roof so the third one, just as you're coming out the back of the house, you're going to see the balloon straight ahead of you. So all you need to do is just make your way around, making some platforms, and then walk behind the gazebo and just shoot it. As simple as that. And then moving on to the fourth one, this is going to be at the very top of the tower. Uh, oh, not at the very top, but this one's just as you're going up the ladder. And you're going to see it just outside the window there. And moving on to the fifth one, which is actually on top of the very, very top of the tower. So make your way outside, make a little ramp, and then 
jump off and shoot a balloon up to it and you should be able to hit it. So the final one on the nursery is just after the story page. You can see it's right next to it on the left hand side there. So the final part to this chapter is the King's Monument. There are five balloons and the first one is just after this uh, electric uh, electrified ladder you're going to see this big hole and if you look down it there's the first balloon moving on, on to the second balloon this is just at the lemon tree and if you turn to the right and look up there is the balloon right in the corner there moving on to the third one you're going to be climbing up the side of the uh, building as the water's rising and just before you get into this tower if you look onto the right hand side there is the third balloon the fourth one is just at the top of this tower you're gonna come through the hole and what you're gonna want to do is turn around and get onto the roof quickly uh, because the water is rising so you're gonna have to be quick with this one uh, so once you get out like I said jump on to the tower's roof and look up and you should see the balloon on a bit of wood right by the uh, by the moon there so it shouldn't be too hard to spot and the final one in chapter 3 and the king's monument is just after the previous one as you're going around the corner you're going to see it on this uh, tower just out to sea so it should be pretty easy to spot so once you got that that is the final one of this chapter hope you enjoyed the video and on screen now you're seeing some links to some other guides that I've done so thanks again for watching and I'll see you guys next time.